Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. This is London Tay. If you are new here, what's up? My name is London Tay, but my real name is Taylor. If you are an OG subscriber, what's up? Hey girl, how you doing? So, today I'm just going to show you guys how I preserve my curls to make my wash and go last. Now this, this isn't going to work for everyone, of course, but this works for me. Considering the, the length of my hair and considering how I sleep and everything, I like hair with volume. I like hair with volume, you know? Volume, you know? So, saying that, I do um, manipulate my hair just a tiny bit. Um, I do use a spray bottle whenever I wake up and I fluff my hair. I use a spray bottle just to kind of get those curls that may be a little bit out of shape, get those curls back popping. So, I'm just gonna show you guys what I do to preserve my curls. Now, I sleep on my back or on my left side. So, what I like to do with my hair is, what I like to do is I like to split my hair in half. Just like that. Um, like I said, since I sleep on my left side, this is my left side. So, instead of me like preserving my curls down here, which I know that my curls are going to get smashed, I preserve my curls all the way up here. So what I like to use is these clamps, okay? I do one in the front, okay? And then I get another clamp, and I do one, I do one in the back. Just like that, okay? As far as the other side, I either do it the same way, or I just do it midway. So I'll clamp the front and clamp the back like that. That is how I do my hair. They don't have to be even, they don't have to be cute, but that is how I preserve my hair. If you know that you are a sleeper and you toss and turn while you sleep and things like that, I say the highest you can get it is the better. But I don't like to do that one pineapple because your I feel like your hair gets too out of shape doing that. So I like to use I like to use this method. Now, like I said, if you're a wild sleeper, then bring your clips up higher. Like so. So it almost looks like, like a pineapple, but it's not. Now, if you have shorter hair, what you're gonna do is you are going to split these sections in half. So instead of doing two puffs, like if your hair doesn't fit in two puffs, you are going to either get clamps like this and split your half in half and have one puff, one puff, one puff, one puff. So you end up having four puffs in total. The shorter your hair is, the more puffs I suggest you guys do, okay? Now, when I take a shower, what I like to do is I like to have my hair still in the puff and then I like to use one of those very sturdy, secure plastic caps. I use one of those. And then I literally use two or three plastic caps, the clear ones, the cheap ones, and then I use a big bonnet, and then I cover all of that up. Just to be ensure that nothing is getting wet, okay? If you feel like the bonnet is slipping off or slipping forward, then you should tie a scarf around your edges. But try your best not to get your hair wet, because once you get your hair wet, especially the roots, it's gonna start looking crazy. So once I wake up in the morning time, and I took my shower and everything and I take the bonnets off, my hair still pretty much looks like this. Now, it's always some curls that's a little frizzier. So what I do is I just take the clamps back out. And these are the clips that I like to use. I like to fluff on my fingers. And it usually looks like this. Now, like I stated, if it's some parts that are frizzy or some parts where I feel like my curls could be a little more defined, but what I like to use is this product. This is the Apple G Foam Wrap Mousse. And what I like to do is, so let me see if I can find a curl that's a little frizzy. Oh, right here, let's, let's try this one. So I'll, I'll get some mousse and just run it along your curl.
okay like so and then your curls are back popping if you want to get them really defined you can just twirl them around your finger like so so guys i hope this video was short and sweet and to the point and informative and if you have any more questions or any video requests make sure you comment that below and um until then bye guys and i will see you guys in my next video bye guys